hey for all you book clubs out there, Night Road is a great choice for your next gathering. It's a book that offers a lot of meaty uh, issues to discuss from love, loss, redemption, teen drinking, helicopter parenting, guilt and remorse. Let's pretend for a second that I'm at your meeting and I'm gonna give you a couple of questions just to get you started. One of the powerful themes in Night Road is about motherhood and the balance that a mother has to find between letting go and holding on to her children. What's your take on what the kind of mother Jude was? How do her experiences and choices reflect your own? What do you think she did right in parenting? And what did she do wrong? For years, Jude promised her teenage children that they could call her any time, day or night, if they found themselves in trouble, if they got caught up at a party or were drinking or found themselves in a dangerous situation, they could call home and she would come pick them up, no questions asked. But when push came to shove and that moment came, Jude found that that was a more difficult promise to keep than she had thought. What do you think? Do you think that it's okay to pick up your children no questions asked? Or do you think that if you do have to pick them up, you should talk to them about their drinking and their behavior? Did Jude make the wrong choice? What choice would you have made? Lexi comes from a very different world than the Faradays. Um, she comes from a very disadvantaged background. How do you think her difficult past plays into the choices that she makes in this book? Do you think she would have made the same choice on that fateful night if she had not come from such a difficult childhood? By the end of the novel, Jude learns that in a sea of grief, there were islands of grace, moments where she could forget all that she had lost and she could remember what she still had and find peace and joy in the life that remains and in the family that she still has. What do you think about that? Do you think it's possible to really get over a deep and profound tragedy? Or are you changed in a way that in some small way you'll never really be happy again? Well, there's a few questions to get you started. You can find more discussion guide questions in the back of the trade paperback version of Night Road. And I hope you use it and take it to your book club and have a great time discussing the book.